13 on your side sports sponsored by Van Dyke Mortgage. With ninth ranked Michigan State on the horizon, it would have been easy for number six Michigan to overlook Northwestern. Fortunately for the Wolverines, that did not happen. Granted, they weren't perfect, but all that matters going into next week is that their record still says they are. Jim Harbaugh and company fresh off a of bye week early on, though, in Ann Arbor. Their offense didn't look too sharp. Just before the half, U of M looked like it was going to add to its lead, but then disaster. Mike Sain was still fumbling the ball. Wildcats on it. Wolverines only led by three at the break. Second half, they looked a lot better. Their first drive of the third results in a touchdown. Blake Corum with the second of his two scores also had 119 yards. That put Michigan up 10. Later, after a block punt, Michigan would get it back. Then Hassan Haskins would put it back in the end zone. Two touchdowns for him and 110 yards rushing. It's becoming a rout. Fourth quarter now. Northwestern completely shut down. Ryan Hilinski throwing. Look at DJ Turner here after two tips. Gets the interception. Harbaugh called it one of the best he's seen this year. Michigan takes it 33-7. to Despite the slow start, Harbaugh says his team impressed him. I thought our guys did another great job. Oh, they certainly did. And so up next for Michigan is MSU. Spartans off. Like Michigan, they are 7-0. and All right, got to be honest, I am not feeling too good about Western Michigan right now. I mean, it wasn't just losing another MAC game. It was how they lost it. Broncos on the road taking on Toledo. They fell behind early, but they returned fire in the second. Caleb Elby faking and taking. 14-yard touchdown after a missed extra point. Western Michigan trailed 13-9. Later in the quarter, Ellaby doing it with his arm this time. Downfield for Sky Moore. 39-yard gain to set up a Sean Tyler touchdown. Broncos led 15-13 at the break. Then the third quarter started, and it was all downhill from there. After scoring a touchdown on offense, Toledo's defense would get one as Zachary Ford takes it 35 yards off a of fumble. After getting shut down in the second half, WMU goes on to lose 34-15. They're now 2-2 two and two in the conference, two games out of first. In Division Three, Hope staying hot. Flying Dutchman got it done at home, beating Adrian 19-7. That's four wins in a row now for Hope, who improves to 6-1 this year. Finally, hate to do it, but got to conclude things on a down. Red Wings, man, rough night at Montreal. After taking a 1-0 lead, they gave up six straight goals, including three from Matthew Perot, who scores off the rebound on this one. Detroit drops its second straight game, losing 6-1. And that's sports. Michael Barron's coming back with your final forecast next.